seeding was invented a long time ago, uh, some decades ago, and it was really it was really to make rain. It was for, it was where we put um, uh, nuclei into the cloud to make it rain. In in, in essence, um, every raindrop needs nuclei, and, and what the idea was is for parched lands where farmland, agricultural land that hadn't uh, it hadn't rained there for a long time, it was to try to make it make it rain. So this. If you like for the Olympics, the the, the stuff that we're looking at um, is to, is the opposite. It's to it's to it's we're trying to sort of not make it rain, but in actual fact, what we're trying to do is make it rain somewhere other than the place you don't want it to rain. Does it all make sense? Yeah, no, sure. So you catch the clouds before they come over the UK, effectively, or the whatever area of the UK that yeah, you want to spare I, I, the rain. I think it's not a, in in our case. It might be it might well tr- try and make it rain on Reading or Slough rather than London. That wouldn't be very fair on Reading or Slough, would it? Not not really, no. no. Does it work? Does it genuinely work? Um, it's, it's a bit of a theory. Um, sticking silver iodide or, or, or dry ice, uh, the two favourites, into the sky. Yeah, the, 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 the Chinese did it at Beijing, and they, they said it was successful. But it's, it's, it's subjective, to be frank with you. It's, it's not something that we can say um, categorically works. I think it works to degrees. I think it works in certain situations for good old British weather, um, if ever we were to try it, and I haven't heard that we're going to try it, um, I'm not so sure. And you know what? There's another thing as well running with this, and that um, is these are the British Olympics. This is the London Olympics. And surely if we're going to meddle with the weather, um, it, it seems to go a, a, against the grain. It seems to go... Just, well, it isn't, um, hasn't to... Danny Boyle brought in some rain for the opening ceremony? So Sorry, in case, I, I miss you then. Say again, Phil. I, say, I think Danny Boyle has organised for some rain to be brought in for the opening ceremony, just in case there isn't any on the day. Yeah, that's good of him, isn't it? But I think that well, what he's actually showing there and representing is the fact that Britain does does see its rain, and I think we can all say that with knobs on this 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 time around. Um, and I think to be to be brutal about it, I think. Um, I think it's part of our, uh, part of the British tradition to have the rain. So, you know, the British Olympics without some kind of British weather, if we were in 30 degrees and sunny every day, we might as well be somewhere else.